everyone. In today's video, we will see how to manage the business partner data, master data in SAP S4 HANA ERP system. Uh, for that purpose, we need to first ensure that our uh, roles uh, are correctly assigned uh, to the user. And uh, the role required here is uh, account receivable accountant and account receivable manager as well as the generic role uh, need to be assigned to the user in order to perform the, uh, uh, the activity which we are uh, going to do here. So these three roles are uh, compulsorily assigned to the user in order to uh, perform the customer or business partner's master data updates. So first we need to go identity and access management and maintain business users uh, where we can apply the filter to search the current user and uh, then we need to assign the uh, three roles which I just uh, described account receivable accountant, account receivable manager and generic uh, role. These uh, three roles need to be assigned. So here, uh, the unnecessary roles uh, need to be removed. Okay, and generic role is required. Then account receivable, accountant, and account receivable manager. These uh, two roles need to be assigned to the user in order to perform the activity of updating the business partner master data. We have selected one value and then we need to select the other one. We select it now. We need to press OK, but it is only one has been selected at a time. We need to select the other one, account receivable, accountant. Once uh, these three roles are assigned, then we need to uh, sign out and sign in again for the changes to take effect. Now we need to sign out and uh, sign uh, back in. Okay. The required uh, group where we will be uh, finding the business partner is basically business partner master group. And in that, we need to select uh, maintain business partner tile or app. We need to just uh, log in or sign in. Once we are in, then we need to find the business partner master group. And in that group, we need to select maintain business partner tile, which is here. And uh, so once we click this one, then the screen uh, will open for maintaining the business partner. The maintain business partner screen will open. And uh, in that screen, we need to search for S4C04. Uh, okay, and uh, business partner by number. We need to click a start, and uh, here our business partner is. We need to select this one. 
double click the entry and it will open the screen. Once it's op open, then we need to switch between display to change mode uh, if uh, not already done in order to edit the screen. Okay. One is read only and one is for editing purpose. So we can switch by the, uh, using this button. Then we need to uh, select here uh, the display organization uh, as for CPU display. If you are okay, we need to uh, select the drop down uh, in display in DC uh, uh, role field in the upper part and we need to select customer financial accounting from the list then at the top of the screen we need to choose the company code okay then uh, then in the display organization as for uh, as for C or for role F financial customer accounting view we need to navigate to the correspondence tab which is located at the bottom uh, third number. Okay, in the correspondence uh, tab. We need to set the dunning procedure first and uh, then we need to we need to enter and then four level dunning notice uh, every two weeks. Basically dunning is a process to collect from the customer in a method methodological way uh, and it starts with soft reminders and ultimately our reminders and uh, maybe visits. We need to accounting color need to be O one where you need to be set. Okay, then we need to save the record and we should not leave the screen of a business partner. So we will save the record here. Now we need to set the collections profile and processor. For that purpose, what we need to do on the display organization uh, is for C. Uh, or for role FI customer view in upper part of the screen we need to navigate to display in BP role field and we need to change the BP role uh, to collection management and then uh, we need to select collection profile YTTRF01 and press enter and update the collection segments at the lower part of the screen in the collection segment section we need to set the collection group YT uh, the R01 and search for the specialist ID. Okay, specialist ID uh, should be S4C01. Collection group is already set, and we need to now select the specialist ID. Here our value is, we need to save it and then we need to exit. That's it guys, I hope you enjoy the video, please subscribe to my channel, thank you for watching.